championship bout of the evening features the super heavyweights. In the red corner, from Miami, Florida, he's 32 years old. I'm sorry, from Sunrise, Florida. They're also 32 years old, six foot, 232 pounds. Please welcome Michael Falsley. And in the blue corner, out of West Palm, he's 34 years old, a six foot, 222 pounder. Let's greet Matt Ives. All right, heavyweight finals. Michael Baltz in the red corner, Matt Ives in the blue corner. Ives is coming off that big knockout of Glen O'Day. Baltz is coming off a long fight with Joe Guadalupe. We'll see what happens here. Ooh, nice kicks by Baltz. Ives comes in with his own. Got a little accidental contact in the face, but he's all right. Just shaking hands. Nice kicks by Baltzley. Ooh. Little axe kick, went over the top. Baltzley was able to push him right down with that. No point so. Again, coming in with some good kicks. Blocked though by Ives. Now he tries with the punches. Slow pace, not really much uh, power on these shots, so we're trying to feel each other out, I guess, see what uh, is going to be effective for each other. Ives has uh, got a little advantage in uh, these rounds. Uh, Baltz is doing a great job so far. There we go, big punches by Ives, putting his body into it. Baltz is able to tie him up, stop him from throwing the punches. Good late kick by Baltz. Good knees, able to catch him, take him down. No points on that, they'll stand him right back up. Both fighters in very phys good physical condition for this. Side kick, Matt tries to come in with that, uh, put some pressure on there, his bolts are turned, throwing those knees in there. Three seconds, referee separates him. Shots, nothing uh, with any power on them. And that's the end of round number one. Take a look at some of it. Nice kick, but uh, didn't land. Again, another kick that didn't land. And uh, Baltzy looks like he's uh, a little more of the uh, stronger fighter of the two. Outweighs uh, Matt Ives. Round number two now. All right, Score still three, zero, no zero. Decibels. Don't wait to show these guys they rate. Tell them they're great. That's who's coming in on Ives. Ives hasn't thrown a technique yet. Oh, nice little kick, but good block. Oh. And Bolsey loses his balance. And they continue. but uh, didn't do anything with it. We are both trying to set up a uh, big technique here. Neither one of them wants to get caught by the other one. Looks like they both respect each other quite a bit. Good knees. He's catching hold of that leg again. That's about the third or fourth time that Bolsey caught Ives' leg. He's trying to come out those knees. Three seconds, referee stops the action, restarts him. Looks 
that both fighters are trying to just get past these rounds, get the gloves on. Good knees by Ives, not bad at all. It's been uh, the most effective combination I think so far in the fight. So he goes back into the, trying to scoop into the knees. Right, folks, watch the uh, pinching like behind the head. It's illegal in these uh, in the fight. Trying to come in with the front kick on my bolts over there. And it seems like I've uh, picked it up. Oh, nice sweep down, but uh, good hold on by Baltzley. So they go down, no points. But uh, as I was saying, I've seen like he's trying to pressure up a little bit, starting to put a little pressure on. That's the end of round number two. We got round number three coming up. Uniforms are off. Gloves come on. Lutz is still putting that ice on his eye. That's from the fight with Guadalupe. So now we'll, uh, we'll see what's going to happen with the hands now. Could be a different fight as we've seen in a few different fights all night. It was really the deciding factor with Ives fighting the day. The jabs by Baltzy. Not bad jab on Baltzley there. So slide in. Both, good jab on both fighters. Oh, came in with a big right hand. Abs turned his head. Right hand coming around. Not bad on exchange. Both fighters uh, effective with their hands today. Not bad on exchange there for Ives. He's trying to cover up. I think he's trying to slip it to the side so he can come back with that right hand. That is right there. Oh, good left hook by Baltzley. Oh, now Ives is coming back in with his own stuff. Nice jab there by Ives. Oh, big right hand by Baltzley. Didn't even affect Ives there. Just kept coming forward. Good kick, good punch combination. That fight is very effective in this one. Definitely a different fight than to put the gloves on. Oh, nice little right there by Ives. The pepper shots, not much landing. This is the third fight for both fighters. Oh, nice right hook there. Nice right. A little clinching going on. It looks like I was trying to throw the knees. Three seconds and separate. Jab there. Oh, missing the, the right hand for Baltzley. I was trying to capitalize on that. Jabs going on there for Baltzley. And they're slowing the pace down. End of round two. Excuse me, now in three. Good punches there by Ives. Good punches by Baltzley coming back. Ooh, nice right hand. Another good right hand for Ives. All right, round number four coming up. It was a good round for both fighters. Starts off with a left jab. Another left jab for Ives. Trying to come in with those hands. Baltz is coming back with his own. Oh, Ives is landing some good shots there with his, with his punches. Ives is coming back with some knees. Got him clinched up. Three seconds. Separates. 
Oh, good left uh, jab there. Good knee. Oh, he's got him covered up now. But, uh, right off of him. See if he come, comes in with a knee. Looks like he's trying, oh, he's trying to set up that uh, those hands. Have a few little uppercut shots by both fighters. And exchange jabs. And by the combo by Bonsi. A little warning for hitting me in the break. The touch, touch gloves. All right, these guys are taking some real shots, folks. Let's cheer them on. Come on, they're giving it all. The fighters got to be getting tired by this point in time. The fighters a little slow down in the action. Ooh, left jab. I wonder if that uh, swelling over the eye of Balsi is affecting his vision. Oh, missing with that uppercut. Oh, come on, come on, wild shots. A little bit of a land on that. You go down to the ground. So you stand back up. Balsi looks a little That's bit right. tired. He's done a lot of rounds so far. Oh, nice right hand there by Balsi. And that's the end of round number four. Five coming up, so the boxing gloves come off with the grappling gloves go on. And now they can go down to the ground for one minute. And let's get round number five started. Waltz has been on the ground today with Guadalupe. Ives hasn't been on the ground, so we're not sure what he can uh, do on the ground so far. All right, folks, these are the last two rounds of the so no night. There's the first kick. The Super Heavyweight Ives, uh. Championship. Let's really bring it on. Give me that enthusiasm. Go to the tie-up. We'll see what they're going to do. Oh, they go to the ground. Ives is on top in more of a side mount position. Well, he has him around the neck, though. He's probably not going to want to let him go. Oh, and he slides out. Oh, and Ives is in the mount position. Let me see what's going to happen here. What he's trying to go for. Tough to see at this angle. He's trying to go for that arm. Oh, a good reversal there by Baltzley. Now, Ives is probably still holding on to that arm. It's tough to see from this angle. Trying to straighten out that arm. So Baltzley's probably all. holding on to uh, on. his right arm with his left. Now he's trying to put him into the ankle lock. Oh, Baltzley's up. Nice action here. Oh, it looks like it's hurt knives. Oh, he goes down to the ground. Ives is coming up trying to get him off of there. It looks like it's bothering Ives. He's trying to pass it through. Trying to get it up. Oh, he slips it out. He's back into the side mount position now. Good action on the ground. The best we've seen all day. I think that took a lot out of both fighters. One minute's up, so the referee's going to stand him up. Good action on the ground. All right, folks, come on. Give it a last spurt, because they're sure doing it. Coming in with some kicks, a few little punches, nothing major. They're going to the clinch again. We'll see if they're going to want to go to the ground. Knee by Baltzley. And a kick. I was trying to come in with the punch, and then they go to the ground. So we got Baltzley on top. So trying to get in the mount position. There he goes. He's got Five rounds complete, folks. And that's it.
All right, six round, coming up. Really put it together. These guys have fought a good one so far. Both little, little shots coming in. Probably both tired, so they don't have a lot left on their, on their shots, but that was a good kick by Baltzan. Looping punches, wild kick. Right, got him, and down they go. Baltzan's trying to pass over and get into more of a mount position. His head's kind of down, so I just probably want to keep his head there, but Baltzan was able to get it out. So Baltzan's... Uh, in more of a dominant position. I was trying to turn, which is something that Balsa definitely wants to try to get that arm underneath his chin, but it didn't work out. I was back on his back, trying to use his legs to keep him off. I was trying to put him into more of a guillotine choke. His head was able to slide out. Ooh, a lot of tension on the neck. Balsa is a strong guy. He's trying to pull his head Come forward. Up, like they fired up, and they will. I guarantee. Balsa definitely feel that in the morning. Trying to get those legs around him to force him off. But is very strong, so that's going to be very difficult to get. Also, looks like he's got a hold of Ives' arm. Ives holding on to that arm. He's not trying, not letting go of it. There they go. They let go. Now Bels is trying to go with little shots into the body. Kind of in a tough position here for both fighters. So the referee's going to stop him, stand him up. Restarts him. Do a little shot. Oh, not a bad punch to the face there for Ives. Oh, another right hand for Ives. Oh, now Balsi comes back as on his own. All right, folks, this is it. Someone needs some knockout or some kicks. And that's the end of round number six. We're going to sudden death. See some of the action here. Good right hand by Baltzley. For Baltzley, excuse me. I just come back with the uh, left hand then. It's going to go to the scorecards, but the fighters have to reach six points inside the ring. So if that's not the case, then it's going to go to an extension round. That's only in the finals. So it's going to be a sudden death. And by the look of the crowd, cheering like that, I think we're going to go to an extension round. up the scores. At the end of regulation, we have a score from the judges. In the blue corner, Matt Ives has earned five points. Michael Baltzley has earned one. You need six to determine a winner. We're going in the sudden so death. So they go to right extension now. round, sudden death. And this is it. Whoever takes it here. Good kick by Baltzley, coming out. Right. Ives comes in with some hand combinations. Some wild punches by both fighters. Oh, and Baltzley takes one. He's going down. That should be it. And that's it. Ives takes it. He becomes the heavyweight champion for the USA Extreme Challenge. Three points awarded on that. Also coming over congratulating him.